my very capable assistant, sitting to my right. Uh, may I ask you your name? The full name? Uh, the full name. Full name. Lee O. Davis. Lee O. Davis. Mm -hmm. What is the O for? I don't know. I just put it in there. To break up the monotony. My father was, uh, you know. Have I ever seen you before? No, Dad. Anyway, I would like to do a medley of my card trick. Yeah. It deals with a deck of cards, often referred to as a devil's prayer book. There are 52 leaves, all different. That's where you can tell one card from the other. From the back, they remind me of a chorus line. They all look alike. Now, Lee, try and contain yourself. I'm going to shuffle the cards in no unusual manner. Give the deck a cut in no unusual manner. Another cut. And for those that bought the first tape, I think you're aware of what's going on. These are merely false cuts. A false cut is nothing more than a series of cuts that leaves the deck in exactly the same position or condition as before the alleged shuffling. Oh, that's interesting. I thought so. So that what the eye sees, the heart must never believe. You can't see it, but you can hear it. That was E flatly. The deck has not been disrupted. Now then, I'm going to hand you the deck, Lee. They tell me you're a good mixer. No pun intended. And mix the cards. Mix them? Shuffle them? Shuffle them, but don't disrupt the order. Straight no, shuffle? No, I'm kidding. Straight or shuffle, or anything. Okay. You've been to Vegas many times, and oh, they tell yes. me uh, that uh, you, you're a good handler of cards. You're a good mixer. Yes, pretty good. I would want to play cards with you. Take care of that. There's a joke there someplace, yeah. but this is no time for a scavenger hunt. I'm going to shuffle Melange Coupe the deck once more, and if you wish, give it a cut. Satisfied? Complete, yes. Completing the cut. Yes. Now, Lee, this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to commit myself. By that I mean I'm going to look specifically for one card. You shuffle the deck, you cut it. Yes, sir. All right. And I must admit that you did shuffle the cards in a... <laughs> As a matter of fact, I'm looking for one card, Lee, if you'll bear with me. I'm going to place it right over here. Uh-huh. Here it is. Right there. I've committed myself. Yes. That card, its identity is only known to me. But to take it one step further, as I deal the cards out onto the table, as such as I'm doing, you tell me when to stop. Any time at all. Stop. Here, here, or here. Ten of diamonds, big casino. Now watch this, Lee. I have two parcels of cards. Whichever one you want me to use, that's the one we'll use. Now this is no force. Oh, I see, this one. This one, all right. Mm -hmm. You sure now? Yeah, that's right. Lee, I'm going to give the deck one cut. I'm going to turn this card over. This happens to be an ace. That might represent me, number one. You can't get any lower than that. Or but higher. By, or higher. By virtue of the fact that it's an ace, I'm going to spell out one card for each uh, letter. A, C, E. Now, there are three cards, two face down, one face up. Would it prove interesting if this card coincided with that one? In other words, this being an ace, would it prove interesting if that were an ace? Oh, I'd say so, yes. Now, I've committed myself. This was my predicted card. Yes. There's an ace. Ah. Try and contain yourself. Here's the third ace. Conclusively, I've shown you the ace of hearts, ace of spades, ace of diamonds. You know what's missing? Why? The ace of clubs. What?